right, we are ready to continue the playthrough. So we just finished the Act 1 and now the first card of the Act 2 will be instruction how to set up this Royal Motor Pool. So since I'm playing historical uh, game I need to set it up from 6 to 1 in this sequence. So we take all of these token that, that represents the cars with their occupants and we place them in the correct numbers. Now if you not doing historical you draw from the cup randomly placing tokens from left to right until you fill them from number 6 to 1 but it could happen like if you taking number randomly it could take be the card number 4 is actually on 6 and so on. So these are the cards cars and these are their occupants. In the first car was Fekhrim Cucic and Dr. Gerde. Uh, Fekhrim Cucic was the mayor of Sarajevo and Dr. Gerde was the chief of police. Uh, we have some Arch Archduke security. In the third car was Franz Ferdinand, Sophie and Gavrilan Kocerek. Fourth car was uh, Eric von Merizi, Count Alexander von Bos Veldek, some Sarajevo police and Palos and Turej. So these are the cars and we set the speed of the rail motor pool to slow and then we place the rail motor pool token on the left my white space on the board here so cars have start coming to this road and their objective is to get to the Sarajevo town hall all right and then we remove this card from the game and continue playing the game normally. So first we're gonna roll for actions as always. I'm gonna get three actions and three events. So let's see what I wanna do here. So there is a really interesting card here which I want to purchase. But I need to increase someone's suspicion. So let's set the suspicion of Trivko Grabesh to 1 and purchase this card, card. Because later on I can exchange the position of two assassins in any sector. Uh, all right. Then I'm gonna spend one action, and I'm gonna try to pull uh, to do a diversion with Svetko Popovic. I'm gonna increase his suspicion. I'm gonna try to bring this policeman to this sector. Okay, unsuccessful. Okay, so with this card, if I spend an action, I can decrease the number of bystanders in two different sectors by minus one. Okay, let's do that. I'm gonna spend one action and I'm gonna decrease number of bystanders here and here. And this card will go out of the game. And I still have one fast action. I think I'm just gonna spend it to try to Actually, I'm going to spend it to activate Gavrilo Principe. Because I want to, later on, I want to lower his suspicion. I mean, stress a bit. Because although I have three assassins here, all of them are really stressed, and using a bomb is not a really... It's the most random thing you can do during the assassination, because the pistol is much better I think. So I'm hoping Gavlo Principe is actually be the guy who's gonna try the assassination. Alright, now you I don't have to roll 20 arrest or fatalism but we have a raw motor pool which now gonna do a roll for it. Oh yeah, before we do that we still have our three events. 
Okay, so move the raw multiple token one space to the Sarevo town hall. So it's just gonna move. Roll a d6 on result of 1 to 3. Move all policemen from the Chumunia bridge sector to the Latin bridge sector. We don't have any, but I'm still gonna have to roll. So it would normally happen, but we don't have any policemen. If more than two policemen were moved, increase stress of Gavrol Prince by two. Well, they are not, so it's fine. And lucky enough, there is no a third event on this card. To purchase this, I need an action, any kind of action. And later on, if I use the first action, this card, this card, to move one active assassin to any space in one sector of your choice. Mm. Wow, so that's like teleportation. Maybe something I want to purchase later on. All right. So now we check to see will the Royal Motor Pool uh, move. I'm gonna use this die. So how does it work? You ro roll one d6 on five or more. Uh, it's gonna move. Uh, there is a plus one modifier for a slow movement. So let's see. It's a six, so the car is gonna move. And then, if it moves, you continue rolling until it actually is not moving anymore. So this, in this way, a uh, car actually can pass some of your conspirators. Uh, all right, so this will move here. Interesting. Car continue to move. Okay, and now it's gonna stop because two plus one is three. It's lower than five. So car has stopped in front of Nedel Kochabrinovich for now. We're gonna roll for action, and then we're gonna decide what we wanna do. That is only one action and two events this turn. So if I would wanna attack the car, I can't do it because first of all I would need at least two actions because I need one to flip him to the active side and then try to attack but I don't think any of these conspirators is actually gonna attack uh, why because I played this game before and I think that the bomb like you want to use a bomb only if if you are desperate enough because with the pistol you have a much better chance your assassination is gonna succeed so I'm probably want to spend this one action to try to lower the stress of Gavrilo Princip. And I failed to do so. Alright, now we have two events. Uh, if Mohamed Mechenbashic is out of the game, he is not, so we skip it. Roll for the Royal Motor Pool speed change. Okay, so this could be something good or bad for us. So I roll a 1. And you can see here that if I roll a 6, the speed would change to moving. If I roll 1 to 3, it stays slow. 4 to 5, it goes fast. So it's going to stay slow, actually. Okay, and then if Gavrilo Princip is inactive, decrease his suspicion by 2 spaces. If he is active and doesn't have a Fatalism token, give him a Fatalism token. Alright, so what this means? Uh, multiple things. So when you have your Fatalism token, your stress can't rise anymore. And uh, you can still lower it because you're active. Also, you can't go f to inactive state anymore. So if I get suspicion, I've, I will have a problem with the police. But this token also give me minus 3 DRM to the assassination attempt. So it's kind of good or and bad thing in the same time. For now, he just like fatalism is his way to, to perform this assassination. All right. Oh, wait a minute. There are only two events. So no, this third one will not happen. I just noticed there are only two events I need to perform. All right. Purchase this card here. I have to increase the stress of one of the 
characters this is what this little head with the like uh, electricity inside means but this is a really good card and I'm gonna do it I'm gonna increase stress of the of Privko Grabers and I'm gonna purchase this card and then we'll see will the Royal Motor Pool move no it's not gonna move alright let's roll for our actions oh I have four actions and three events all right since I want to show you how the assassination attempt goes I'm actually try to perform it right now uh, just uh, just to show you how tough it is although this is not a perfect thing to do right now I still think that my best option would be the Gavrilo principle of someone else with a pistol now as I said I can still use a pistol but I will get uh, no negative DRMs which I need so let's see is it is it something I want to do so first I would need to spend one action to activate Neden Kuchabrinoj because he is now in position to, to do something about it so that would cost me one action alright then I will have to spend another action to Uh, let's try to lower his stress a bit five or six no let's do it again no so the last action I'm gonna use to perform the assassination attempt roll alright so let's do it he's in correct position and I'm gonna use a pistol not a bomb now I don't have a pistol proficiency I actually have a bomb proficiency and you can see here if I have a pistol uh, if I have a bomb proficiency I have minus one to DRM roll so let's calculate what I need to roll so there are two bystanders here okay then uh, his stress is also added so plus two Uh, then let's see he doesn't have any weapon proficiency so that's just zero he doesn't have fatalism uh, raw motor pool speed is slow so that's plus two more but well what uh, having him in the same sector with us is actually not that good because this minus two goes to his assassination roll attempt so when he rolls a dice he's gonna have minus two to them that's what this means but we need to roll a dice first so he needs a six or higher with a minus two from Vaso because he's in the same sector with Nedeljko Čabrinović all right so I'm using a pistol so let's see how that works it says using a pistol you have five attempt rolls minus stress of the assassin that is attempting assassination so right now instead of five I have three shots because my stress is two so we summarize all dice modifiers to calculate the number you have to roll on 2d6 dice and roll must be equal or higher than that sum to produce a hit and roll for each hit separately but you have minus two for each roll after the first one now I already have minus two because Vasu is there he's kind of clumsy and just messing all this thing up so I have minus two to my rolls to, f to my first roll but I'm gonna have minus four to my second and the third roll so you can already see that this assassination attempt will be a really tough one but I just want to show you how it works and why you shouldn't do this and why you should like invest into your best option because it's really hard to 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 perform a uh, perfect assassination in this game okay so let's do it 
basically roll number one with the minus two. Uh, and don't forget that his suspicion is two. So I got a seven, but since his suspicion is two, if I roll at least one or two on a any dice, I am immediately uh, arrested and I fail the assassination. So that that's how this suspicion works. So sadly, no no other no other attempts. Someone from the crowd, I guess, see me, sees and stop me. It doesn't have to be a police, and I am arrested. Can I do anything about it? This is an action, action, no, I can't right now. Alright, so what happens next? Let's read the arrest part. If there is at least one arrested assassin, at the end of the turn, roll 2d6 for each other assassin on the board. Add their suspicion and the number of arrested assassins to the value you just rolled. On 11 or more, they have also been arrested. So that's going to happen at the end of the turn. Right now, when you try to perform the assassination and it fails, immediately this speed goes too fast. And it's not going to be moved, so I'm just going to place it here. As all the cars are now speeding up from the, from the incident. So let's roll for the car movement. Six, uh, it's going to move. Four plus two, it's still six, it's going to move. It's gonna move because there is a plus two modifier for it for fast it's gonna move again and I don't have any fast action to attack it again right now it's gonna move so it's speeding up past all the other assassins okay two plus two is four so it's gonna be here somewhere now we're gonna check are there others gonna be arrested as they capture the Nedel Kuchabrinovich and by the way I can remove him from this part, I'm gonna put him here. He's now arrested. So let's see, will he talk and you know uh, tell on the other conspirators? Let's start with the Muhammad Mehmed Bashic. So we add his suspicion and the number of arrested people. So one arrested people and his suspicion is two. So that's a plus three to the this dice roll. That's a six plus three is nine. He's not be he's not gonna be arrested. Let's see for Basso. It's also plus three to, to his check. He's not arrested. Uh, next in line is Trivko Grabish with the plus two. But he got eight plus two is ten, so he almost got arrested. Uh, the next next is Svetko Popovic with the plus three the roll he's fine and lastly uh, Gavrilo Princi with the let's see one arrested one okay plus two to the roll seven plus two is now he's also not arrested all right so so far at least he didn't talk about other conspirators but it doesn't mean next round is gonna be like that next turn so we continue uh, I still have the events to perform. Oh, I totally skipped the events. Oh my god. But the car would be here anywhere, so let's just do the events. The event should be played after the assassination attempt anyway, because I didn't have any actions. Move one policeman from Austrian Hungarian bank sector to the Chumuria bridge sector. Uh, decrease the number of bystanders in Latin bridge sector by one. So this goes to three. And if the number of bystanders in the sector with Nedeljko Chabrinovic is 3 or higher, increase his stress by 1 space. So he would stress would be actually here. But that would happen after I perform this assassination, so it wouldn't affect the role. So we are fine. Let me check. Oh, but this thing here would affect lots of things if I play this correctly but let's leave it 
for now like this so as you can see my assassination attempt was complete failure the guy was arrested but I knew it would happen basically I just wanted to show you how, how tough it is now I have one more chance and that's Gavrilo Princip so let's roll for for actions I roll a double so that's gonna be two actions one normal one fast and only one event so let's play this correctly this time so what can I do to help the Gavrilo Princip well I can do a diversion with Rivko Grabesh and try to pull this policeman from here to here so I need 5 or 6 no he didn't succeed to do that and his suspicion rises I have to keep my fast action for now because uh, either I'm gonna move or maybe attack depending where the royal motor pool will be so I'm keeping it so maybe I can attack maybe at the end of the turn or we'll see how it's gonna work okay we have one event decrease the number of bystanders in one sector of your choice to its starting value Ooh. well let's do it here starting value was 2 so we're gonna do that there if Nedeljko Chabrinovic is not active increase his stress by one space well he's arrested so we, ju we don't even do anything about that oh wait only one event so we don't do the rest uh, okay nothing all right so now let's roll for the royal motor pool movement yes it's gonna move it's gonna move so now is my chance when it when it, if it gets to me I have a fast action to react and, and shoot at it yes it's gonna move all right so I'm gonna use my fast action this is how you react to the things on the map so before it continues you moving I'm just gonna step in front of it I guess with the cover of princip and we're gonna use a pistol so this is my second attempt okay let's see what I need to roll uh, so I have five attempts minus stress so his stress is three so I'm gonna have only two shots and on my second shot I'm gonna have minus two modifier okay let's see what we need to roll to hit so there are two bystanders here one policeman which is plus three uh, let's see uh, his stress is also three damn it's a big number he has a weapon proficiency with the pistol so that's a minus two uh, what else no fatalism and royal motor pool speed is fast so that's a plus three so that's a five eight eleven minus two it's nine or higher to hit and on the second hit I have a minus two so probably just one shot okay let's try okay how much is my suspicion only one okay so if I roll only one side I'm so I got a seven so that's a miss so nothing happens so that was my first shot now my second shot with a minus two to the roll wow I really need a big number here and I got another 7 minus 2 that's a 5 so that's two misses as the as the car was speeding uh, past him he, he shot two <laughs> shots missed and immediately he also get arrested because once you perform the attempt you just get arrested alright so that's what happened and now we're gonna roll to see will others be also arrested so let's start with Muhammad Mehmed Basic again Let me. so his suspicion is two with the two more guys in here he has a plus uh, four to this roll so that's a seven plus four that's eleven so he's also arrested
join join them in the prison next one is Vasa Trubrilovic he has a two suspicion plus three arrested people so he has a plus five to this role with the uh, eight plus five that's more enough so he's arrested too uh Trivko Grabesh two suspicion plus four that's a plus six to the roll definitely arrested and only Cvetko Popovic left with the two suspicion plus uh, five guys here that's a plus seven to his roll on 11 plus he also get arrested he got a six uh, how much is it plus six yes he's also arrested and that's a game over and that's what happened in this game Nedeljko Čabrinović tried to shoot someone from the from the bystander noticed that stop him is immediately arrested the cards pass uh, the car goes into the fast mode passed by Trivko Grabež and Cvetko Popović and uh, just when they're passing uh, close to <laughs> Gavrilo Princip he also managed to uh, sh he tried to shoot I guess but he missed both times and the car just speed up to the Sarajevo town hall while the other conspirators one by one were arrested that same day so as you can see one wrong movement in this game and you're gonna lose it pretty soon but as I said I just wanted to show you so I'm gonna pause this playthrough but I'm gonna revert the game to the starting position before we started uh, playing the second act and I'm gonna play it again but correctly so this was just a test all right so I'm gonna play it correctly to see how if you give your character the best possible chance to to assassinate Arch Fr French uh, Archduke Franz Ferdinand you have a better chance to win so anyway thanks for watching and see you in the next episode where we're gonna turn back a time a bit and try again uh, goodbye